So today I will be sharing with you a wool wrap skirt that I made and it is Simplicity 8746. I made it in this plaid fabric and it has, um, well let me show you the back. The back is just plain and it does have D rings with the belt going through the D rings and then the wrap is over to the front left. There is also a button inside. I just put a little stabilizer in there, some interfacing. So there's a button inside to keep it closed in the front. There was supposed to be a center seam in the back. So all of the pieces for this pattern are cut out in one flat piece. It's not on the fold or anything. And they wanted you to cut out the back piece one time and flip it over and then cut out the other back piece. But I didn't want to have to match the plaid in the back or anything. So I just took the back piece and I just traced out the back piece and taped it together and just made one big back piece so that I wouldn't have to worry about a center back seam. Um, it's pretty long. The front on the right hand side is a little bit longer. It hangs a little bit lower in the front on that side than it does on the left side. So it's supposed to wrap over and hang a little bit lower. And I might have my right and left mixed up. I'm not sure because <laughs> I tend to do that sometimes. But yeah, one side does hang a little bit lower than the other. Yeah, so I really like this and it came together fairly quickly. I was surprised and I will go ahead and show you what this looks like on. So that is my wrap skirt. I really, really like it. And before I go, I want to leave you with a love share. My love share for today is that when going out to eat and you receive the bill to pay for your meal, I learned recently that some people like to t tip based off the full grand total of the whole meal with the tax included. And then some people like to tip pre-tax. So they look at the amount that's above the tax and then they tip on that amount. I had no idea that some people do it one way and some people do it the other. So I thought that that was so interesting and I wanted to share it with you. So thank you so very much for watching.